In this video, you will see a brief demonstration of the NetSuite Add Customer plugin for Informatica Cloud. This plugin allows you to create and synchronize customer data in NetSuite based on source data in a database, flat file, or salesforce.com. In this demo, new accounts that have been created in Salesforce will be added to NetSuite using Informatica Cloud. Let's begin by verifying that the customer does not currently exist in NetSuite. From the NetSuite homepage, I will perform a global search using the term Acme. Notice that the search does not return any records, meaning that there are currently no customers named Acme in NetSuite. To leverage the power of the NetSuite Add Customer plugin, you simply create a data synchronization task, add the plugin, and map the data fields. Let's begin by creating a new data synchronization task. I'll give the task a name and select Insert as the operation. I'm going to select Salesforce as the source connection and account for the source object. Because the plugin writes data to NetSuite behind the scenes, the actual target for the task will be an output file where the results of the task are written. I'll select that file now. I'm going to define a simple data filter so that only records that have been added to Salesforce since the last time I ran the task will be processed. I'll filter on the last modified date in Salesforce and use the variable last runtime. On the field mappings page, I will add the NetSuite plugin to my task. Now I will map fields from the Salesforce account object to the NetSuite customer record. Lastly, I will create simple decode expressions for the country and subsidiary fields so they are in the proper format that NetSuite is expecting. Next, I'll map the plugin fields to the target file. Now I can validate the mapping and click Next. Lastly, I'll assign the task to a daily schedule so that it runs automatically each day. My task is now complete and I can save. I'm going to create a new account in Salesforce. This account will be the Acme Corporation.
can now run the task in Informatica Cloud. When the task completes, the activity log is displayed and I can see that the task has returned one success row. This is for my Acme account I've added in Salesforce. The final step is to return to NetSuite and search once again using the term Acme. This time the search returns the Acme company record. You can see that all the details entered in the Salesforce account record are present in the NetSuite customer record. This video showed you how simple it is to use the NetSuite Add Customer plugin in Informatica Cloud to synchronize accounts between Salesforce and NetSuite.